All right. <clears throat> Whoa. Whoa. What is good, everybody? It is your boy, Champagne Chico, and we are here with something new. With something new. As of right now, I am working on my scary game video for next week. It's going to be a good one, so stay tuned for that. I'm, I'm editing as best as I can for that one. But today, we're going to be having a, a crossover grid. We're going to be having a crossover grid. And it's going to be any NBA and NFL that I'm going for today. That's the two that I really play on this channel a lot. Um, and it's the two that I know the most about, you know? If you don't know what a crossover grid is, it's basically what it's what the title is. It's pretty self-explanatory. It's crossover. So I have to find a player that was on the 49ers and the Dolphins, and I have to put them in that box. Now, once I put them in that box, I can't use them again. So as you can see, one of the categories is caught receiving touchdown from ryan fitzpatrick say it was the dolphins and the commanders so where, where the lines is it was the commanders and i put ryan fitzpatrick there i can't use ryan fitzpatrick for the rest of the time so i can just do an example right now because i already know one of the players that i'm going to pick and it's the 49ers and the dolphins it's a current running back on our team and it is jeff wilson if he's able to come up I don't know if his real name's like Jeffrey Wilson or something, but I'm not risking that at all. I want to be golden on this. So I have to think of another player that played for the 49ers, but also played for the Dolphins. Well, I'm going to go back to the Dolphins and the 49ers, and I'm going to put Raheem Mostert. Jeff Wilson and Raheem Mostert used to play for the 49ers, and now they play for the Dolphins. So that's a pretty easy one right there. Buffalo Bills and 49ers. I think I'm going to jump down here. So caught a receiving touchdown from Ryan Fitzpatrick. Did Devontae Parker catch one from Ryan Fitzpatrick? He did. He did. Devontae Parker did catch one on the Dolphins from Ryan Fitzpatrick. Um, on the Bills. Was Cole Beasley on the team back then? That was a pretty stupid stupid idea that cole beasley played at the same time as ryan fitzpatrick on the bills i don't know why i thought that i i just woke up take that excuse as you will but 2009 to like 2013 was when ryan fitzpatrick was on the bills um they did have to at one point i can't remember too much about the other wide receivers i'm gonna go out on a limb that terrell owens caught a touchdown from ryan fitzpatrick and he did he did indeed only 14 percent guessed that yeah he was on the team in 2009 he wasn't there for long but terrell owens is basically a guaranteed touchdown at least one a season you know um lions dolphins oh 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 uh deshaun elliott Deshaun Elliott just joined the uh, Dolphins as a safety, and he did play. They don't even have his headshot, but he did play for the Lions, and only 2.1% of people guessed that. So, doing pretty well right here. Ooh, I'm trying to think Texans. When did he play for the Texans? Was it like 2014? Who was on the team at that point? Because the Texans have always basically been irrelevant. Their wide receivers, their best wide receiver in the past like 20 years has been DeAndre Hopkins. So, but I don't think he was drafted when Ryan Fitzpatrick was on the team. Uh, I'm going to go out on the limb that DeAndre Hopkins was on the team at that point. I mean, Hopkins is pretty old. Hopkins is pretty old at this point. DeAndre Hopkins did catch a touchdown from Ryan Fitzpatrick on the Houston Texans. So that helps me out a lot there. Oh, this is where I'm kind of getting stuck. I've been avoiding it. You can see um, I made an L right here. Um, but the Buffalo Bills and the 49ers. Damn, I could have used T.O. for that one. I could have used T.O. for that one. I don't know why I didn't think of it. I was too focused on trying to get the receiving touchdown one that I could have used the Bills 49ers and used T.O. I'm pretty sure T.O. was on the 49ers. He turned into a journeyman at one point. Ooh. I'm going to have to dig deep. I'm probably going to use one of the oldest trick in the books. Um, another big journeyman across the league at one point. But whoever got him 
really was happy that they got him in general because he would go and try to get some yards on the season. Frank Gore did play for the 49ers and the Bills at one point. Um, now the Bills and Lions. I've been trying to think QB, and I think I'm pretty set on taking... <sighs> Matt Castle. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but I think Matt Castle did play for the Bills and the Lions. And he did. He did. 20% get that. Texans 49ers. I'm getting pretty stuck the closer that we get to the end of this right here. We're going to go with the recent pickup by the Texans. And it's going to be Jimmy Ward at uh, Strong Safety. Right? Jimmy Ward. Just went to the Texans, was playing with the 49ers last season. Lions, Texans. Hmm. I'm thinking cornerback. I'm thinking defense in general, to be honest with you. And we're going to go with uh, a Lions favorite or a Lions fan fa favorite. Glover Quinn. I think he did play for the Texans. If he didn't, then I hope. I hope I don't get this wrong. And I got nine out of nine on the nfl one it wasn't a horribly bad one i just had to refresh my memory in terms of just digging deep uh deandre hopkins on the texans was a given terrell owens on the bills i did remember that in the slightest bit just because of theme teams in general Devonte parker i am a dolphins fan so i knew when ryan fitzpatrick was specifically on the team uh Deshaun elliott we just got him raheem mostert got him last season frank gore journeyman but a fan favorite matt castle I, I feel like a lot of the nfl fans know who matt castle is glover quinn played for the lions for a while did play for the texans for a short amount of time and jimmy ward just joined the texans so you could say i took an easy way out of this but i think this is a daily thing we're gonna hop over to the nba side hopefully it doesn't take me as long to finish it this isn't this isn't gonna be an easy one carmelo anthony teammate what does rs mean um but on the Pistons, Hornets, or Timberwolves, who's on any of these teams that has played with Carmelo Anthony? J.R. Smith didn't play for the Hornets, Pistons, or Timberwolves. Um, not Amari Stoudemire. Uh, I mean, Carmelo started to build up his teammates. Um, damn. Damn, damn, damn. I did think of one... Carmelo Anthony teammate and I don't think he's played for any of these other teams no I'm tripping but Allen Iverson Allen Iverson did play for the Pistons not not the greatest time for him but he did play for them 27.9% of people guessed that mm. Hornets Carmelo Anthony I feel like this player has played with one of these other teams, but I'm just going to go with it as a Carmelo Anthony teammate. I tried to think deeply about it, but Tayshaun Prince did play for the Timberwolves and played with Carmelo Anthony. I was wrong? I could have sworn. Did I get the wrong Prince? I'm just brain dead. I'm just brain dead. I just fact checked myself. They never played together. I don't know why I thought they played together at all. Oh, man. Oh, Nets, Timberwolves, I am brain dead. Garnett, Kevin Garnett with that supposed uh, super team that they made that didn't do anything but get bumped out the first round almost every year. Kevin Garnett, of course, it's going to be an easy one for a lot of people. Um, I'm just trying to think a little too deep in terms of players. Uh, Thunder Pistons, Thunder Pistons, Thunder Pistons. Um, hmm. I feel like I should know this one. For Minnesota, for Carmelo Anthony, we're going to go with, um, I just had his name in mind, Andre Miller. Andre Miller, he did play. He was a decent player. He just, I don't know, he couldn't stay on the team. I feel like he jumped around almost every season after his rookie contract. So Andre Miller is going to be the one that we pick for Timberwolves and Carmelo Anthony. Now we're only going to be able to get five out of these six squares left. Oh, uh, what else? What else? What else? All right, we're going to go Michael Carter Williams on the, or I have to do it the other way. Carter Williams. Yeah. Michael Carter Williams did play with Carmelo at one point and did play for Charlotte at one point. And he's going to be on there. I want to see how many people put that for that one, but 
All right, so four more guesses, four more boxes that we can go through. We should probably pick the easiest ones, to be honest, but I'm still going to be spending a lot of time here because, oh, wow, 0. 0.7 guess that a recent acquisition by the pistons joe harris did just get traded by the brooklyn nets which could help them out in terms of being included in the tyler hero and damian lillard trade but joe harris what this thing's not updated this thing's not updated this thing is not updated i'm resetting it there's no way there's no way Allen iverson no this thing is not updated at all in the slightest because no because that's stupid he definitely just got traded and it's already confirmed that no no uh andre miller i'm not no i, I want to get this 100 percent, and they're really trying to screw me over i was okay with getting one less but not giving me nets and pistons joe harris is crazy all right we're gonna put blake griffin hopefully it doesn't get give me uh x on this one that shouldn't because Blake Griffin was supposed to be like the pivotal piece for the Nets to make it to the finals. I mean, he did good in terms of the Eastern Conference Finals that one year that Kevin Durant was going insane. But I didn't think that he was going to be all that in a bag of chips. I think we're just going to go ahead and pick up the pace here. Because <laughs> I'm trying to think of like people that a lot of people would know. And it's like messing with my head. Mason Plumlee did play for the Nets and the Hornets. Um, Jeremy Lamb played for the Thunder and Hornets, if I'm not mistaken. He did. Um, oh, Kevin Martin got traded, uh, by the Rockets to the Thunder for James Harden in that one trade. And he did play for the Timberwolves at one point. Kevin Martin... Oh, one last one. Uh, Pistons Thunder. Oh, 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 oh. Um, he got drafted by the Thunder. Reggie Jackson. Reggie Jackson. And then he was talking about how the time that he had in the in Detroit was not good for him. But we did finish the grid. All right. So try again tomorrow. My rank was not that high, but I'm not worried about rank. Blake Griffin for the Nets and Pistons. I mean. Most of this is recognizable. Maybe not Andre Miller uh, or Jeremy Lamb. Not a lot of people know who Jeremy Lamb is. It seems like on this they do, but Andre Miller, I just had to like pull out of my pull out of my back pocket with that one. But I think we're gonna do one more just to even it out. Um, we're gonna go to Unlimited and see. Oh, damn. Damn, that, that would have been cool. That would have been cool if I was able to do another one. Hold on. Damn. It seems like that's going to do it. It does seem like that's going to do it. These are daily, so I'm going to have to wait until tomorrow for the next one. Uh, I'm not too big on MLB, so I don't know if there is an MLB one. I'm not going to be doing it. Uh, I maybe know the older players, but the newer ones, you, you lost me. You lost me. Especially like colleges and stuff for MLB, I won't be able to do that. Yeah, I'm not I'm not going to waste my time trying to go on an unknown website and do it. But I did enjoy doing this. If you enjoyed it, please go down there, like, and subscribe. Let me know if you want to see more of this. We can make this a weekly thing or, or even a daily thing. And I just put it on my reels for you guys to see super quick just to get the crossover grid done for the day. But I did enjoy this. It really picked at my brain because i try to put myself as this person that knows a lot about sports especially basketball but that took me a minute that took me a minute to finish but i did enjoy it and i will see you in the next video peace